Grand Admiral Thrawn's creator, Timothy Zahn, would love to return. Raising the possibility of books, exploring Thrawn's missing nine years on Paradia. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, please subscribe and keep watching for more details. Ahsoka introduced Lars Mikkelsen as the live-action Grand Admiral Thrawn, but left his life over the last nine years something of a mystery. The Ahsoka Disney Plus TV show saw its heroes and villains travel the pathway to Paradia, a mysterious world in a distant galaxy. Grand Admiral Thrawn had been stranded there nine years ago, but he'd clearly been busy. The Imperial strategist had formed an alliance with the Great Mothers, exiled Night Sister leaders, and he seemed to be busy acting across this new galaxy. Although he knew Morgan Elsbeth's arrival in the galaxy was imminent, Thrawn was mysteriously absent when her ship arrived, for unknown reasons. Now Grand Admiral Thrawn's original creator, Timothy Zahn, has spoken out about his hopes of writing at least one novel exploring Thrawn's missing nine years. He discussed the possibility in a panel at Twin Cities Comic Con over the weekend via Star Wars Newsnet and made clear that there's been no official offer from Lucasfilm. Still, despite that he's keen to step up. It's a 10-hour drive from my house to Lucasfilm, he observed. I would do it in eight. Zahn's characterization of Thrawn is a little different to the one shown by Lucasfilm's Dave Filoni, but Zahn promised to play ball. Whatever Filoni wants, I will write it, and you will like it, he assured attendees. The interesting question, of course, is whether Lucasfilm will sign off on a book, or trilogy, exploring Thrawn's missing nine years. The offer clearly hasn't been made yet. Zahn's comments feel very much like an open invitation to begin a conversation that would delight the fan base. What's more, he's well aware Thrawn plays a critical part in Filoni's build-up to an upcoming Star Wars movie featuring Grand Admiral Thrawn as the villain and likely continuing to explore Paradia. That explains why he's stressing how willing he is to work within any limits and requirements Filoni imposes. The problem, though, is that writing even one book takes time. There are generally believed to be at least two shows due to come out before Filoni's Mandalorian-era Star Wars movie, with Lucasfilm likely to course-correct in subtle ways based on popular reaction to these. Still, in the past, there have been tremendous links between the publishing and theatrical branches of Lucasfilm, this is proven through the publishing strategy around Rogue One, a Star Wars story, for example. Ahsoka has left many hoping that relationship could be rekindled. 